Okay, what's going on today guys? This video is going to be for the Tyrannus only. Uh, this is going to be how to set your timer switch up to start your motors. I already did a video on this with uh, my TH9X with uh, ER9X firmware on it and it works perfect on that so it should work perfect on this. Uh, as you can see we got it at this screen. What we're looking for is when you pull your sticks down into the center. I can't do both sticks at the same time, but this is what it's going to look like. So you're going to have three bars here. One, two, three bars here that are black. And this bar right here that's going to be black. So when you pull the switch, that's what it's going to look like. So when we get done with that, when you pull your switch, uh, this will start your motors. And all you got to do is just let off of it to, uh, and let it, and it will stop the motors by itself too. They just won't keep running. So uh, let's just jump into this and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, so you're going to have four mixes. Here's a mix right here on elevator, a mix on aileron, a mix on throttle, and a mix on rudder. So what I did here is I just went in here and I just duplicated this first one and then I uh, went in and edited this one. So this is how it works. Your source is going to be max. Your weight is going to be minus 100. Your switch is going to be SH down. And then replace the file. Don't add it. Replace it. Make sure you replace it. And then hit OK. Your next mix is going to be right here on your aileron. You're just going to duplicate it and then edit it. Your source is going to be max. Your weight again is going to be minus 100. Your switch is going to be SH down replace and then hit OK again then you're going to put one on your throttle your weight uh, your source is going to be max your weight is going to be minus 125 on your throttle SH down replace and then OK and then the last one is going to be on your rudder now this one's a little different so make sure you get this one right your source is going to be max, your weight is going to be plus 100, not minus, plus 100. Your switch is going to be SH down, replace, and then OK. Now I know this works because I, I use this right now on my on my TH9X uh, with ER9X firmware on it. Uh, my Tyrannus will be here soon and uh, I've tested, I've just used this a thousand times so I know it works. Uh, so uh, that's how you set that up if you want to set it up. I did do a video on this on my TH9X once before. I just didn't know. It wasn't the same. Uh, as it's a little bit different than the Tyrannus, but not much at all. It was real simple for me to come in here and set this up. Uh, do because I already have it on my, my TH9X. So uh, there you go. That, will really, that should really help you out. If the other one didn't, you was kind of a little bit confused, uh, this one here should do it. Right now you can just look at it and copy it and just... Put it right in there and it will work. Uh, right now I'm all ready. Uh, just as soon as I get the Tyrannus, I'm, I'm set with everything. All I got to do is just bind it, put the receiver in my, my hex, and uh, do a few tweaks, and I'm ready to go. So uh, I'll be flying it within a few minutes after I get it. So uh, there you go, guys. I hope this helps you out.